I'm Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on scientific notations or standard form. Here is a quick review to understand the concept. Whenever we want to write numbers in scientific notation, we are basically writing them in the form of m times 10 to the power of n, where m is somewhere between 0 to 1, right? Less than equal to, I should say, less than 10. Okay. Where m belongs to, m belongs to real numbers, right? So that is how we write the numbers in standard form. n is the index and that gives you the order of the number. You can always pause this video, complete this table, so half of them almost are you need to write these decimal numbers in scientific notation and for these numbers you have to write decimal equivalent. Now let's begin with the very first one which is 100. 100 can be treated as 1 times 10 square, right? 10 to the power of 2. So that becomes the scientific notation for 100. Now we have 0 0.002. Two. So we need to write this as 2 times. So to bring it to 2, we actually multiply it by 10, 100, 1000, right? So we write here 10 to the power of minus 3, right? So it was 3 places 2 thousandths, right? That is what it is. Correct? This is 2. Okay. So it is written as 2 times 10 to the power of minus 3. So I hope that is absolutely clear. Now the next number here is 123.45. We'll write this as 1.2345 times. Now this is much smaller than the actual number. So we should be multiplying this by 100 to make it same, right? So 100 means 10 square. Is that clear? So I hope in these steps you have understood the process, right? If we have just the number 5, then what should I do? Well, in that case, we'll write 5 times 10 to the power of what? 10 to the power of 0. Anything to the power of 0 is 1, and that is the way to write the number 5 or any individual single digit number in scientific notation. Now we have point 000, 000007. Now in this case you need to write this as 7 times 10 to the power of something and what should that be? It has to be a negative number since this is very very small and how many places? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, right? So it is 10 to the power of minus 7. Is that clear to you? So that is how we get the scientific notation or also called standard form in specially UK for all these decimal numbers. Now let's do the reverse. Writing them back into decimal notation. 3.14 times 10 to the power of 2, which means 100, right? So that will be 314. Two decimal places that decimal moves. Minus 3 means decimal moves towards left, making it smaller, right? So we have this number, 1, 2, 3, 4. Now you moved it one place. Now you have to move two more places. So basically, we'll get two more zeros. Do you see that? So it's good to write a zero before the decimal. So that becomes your number. 9 times 10 to the power of 0 is the number 9, just as we did 5. 6 times 10 is the number 60, correct? So I hope you have got the concept. That is how we do the conversion between decimal uh, notation and scientific notation. Feel free to write your comment, share your views, and if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.